Hey, good morning, friends. Now, this is Vadni's sister, living in the U.S. for over 20-odd years. And she's take a project on in Jamaica and is the first we've seen the project, you know. She's got a farm down here. She's building a house down here. It's absolutely miles from anywhere. The roads were atrocious. We thought, <laughs> we thought, I'm not going to tell you what we thought, you know. But in the road, this is Pam. So, Pam... Yes. Why did you decide to come back to Jamaica? Okay, hi everyone. We are Seventh-day Adventists and we believe in end time living and that things are going to get so bad that you need to do your own thing. You need to leave the cities. You all guys need to leave the cities, come into the country to live, farm and have your own food. So as we take this little tour on our property, our little Eden here in St. Mary, you will see the things that we have been doing. We started out a year ago, it was all bush. And now we have yam over here. We have a nice, this is a nice yam here. We have canes, cassava. Sugar canes. Yes, this is our shed over here. We get the water from the river. We make pump it from the river to the tank and we're building our house. Now it's split level. So we're doing the back first, which is the lower part and then we'll do the front afterwards. We have a lot of coconut trees. If you can look, it's absolutely beautiful. We have a pumpkin patch right there. But the main thing is that we'll have food and we'll be able to survive by ourselves. We have coconut, we can make coconut oil if we want. So we have that. This is our orange tree here. We have guava, we have pineapples. I just started a gunga farm over there along with red peas lentils and the black eyed peas over here and see a little pineapple there coming so god has been good to us this is where we have the gong this is our little shed that we cook in yes we cook over here five minutes to 11 i have a program i have to send off at 11 o'clock oh 10 57. Okay, so over here we started planting bananas. They're coming up over 100 Gross Mitchell and Lakatan bananas. So we'll have bananas. We can make banana chips and planting chips. Right here is a little ginger patch. We had just started two weeks ago. A ginger is coming up. That's ginger. And over here, watch your step. We have an ackee tree behind there, that's pumpkin coming back over there. These are all plantains and bananas. Over 100 lacatan and gross little bananas. I know, and we have plantains, so this is all it right here. It's like a little Eden. But it's comfortable. It's out in the country. It's country living. It's, it's real country living. It's real country living. Her husband has just went over there yep. and he's coming back with coconuts. coconuts right, look at, we have yeah. coconuts all over. Big coconuts. Man. And they're big. And look at the look coconut at the size of the, Come on, let him see the size. Look at the size of the coconut. They, these, these coconuts, you get like 20 ounces of water or 26 ounces of water from one. Whoa. And they are very nice. Very oh. nice coconuts. So we have a lot of coconuts. We can self-sustain. Yeah. And we are encouraging people to come home, return to your island. Over there we have cocoa, we have banana, we have a big patch of sweet potato all there. We are on three acres of land. It's really five acres, but we sold two to a friend. And that's another yam hill we are starting down there on a dasheen walk. Right down there. See the dasheen? They are all standing up now, planted three weeks ago. So God has been good to us and our friends are from Wales. They're across there. They're not here right now, but they're from Wales and they have come home the same time we came back from America. And we're all practicing what we call country living, where you can live off uh, your own uh, land, uh, feed uh, yourself. Are they Seventh-day Adventists as well? They are Seventh-day Adventists also, oh, yes. Wow. And we have people or workmen are not Seventh-day Adventists and they now want to buy land down here to come and live. Ah. So, as I said, the video time has run out as per usual, but I mean, she's put us in the picture. Jamaica is a lovely place to Very come lovely. and live, you yes. know? 
and you know we came through St. Mary this morning and it was beautiful driving along the sea coast you know and let me tell you something about St. Mary you have the least crime in the out of the island in St. Mary yeah. the problem you have is pray the last night. they will take food but breaking into your house rare rare uh -huh. and on that note I have to say thank you very much for this little you know and we you're welcome God bless